Hello guys, this is Mike here at Mac Observer, and today I'll show you 7 easy solutions to fix Mac unable to check for updates. Users should know there's several answers if they receive an unable to check for updates error on their Mac. When receiving this message, users may likely see one of two different messages. The first will contain the check for updates error message, and also say, an internal error occurred. The error message may also say, can't connect to the software server. Regardless of why you are receiving it, there is a fix for this problem. If you need assistance fixing an unable to check for updates error, know that there is a solution available for your Mac. With all the information together, I'm going to take a look at what users can do if their Mac is experiencing an unable to check for updates error. Covering all the bases, I'll not only provide some solutions to this problem, but I'll also take a look at a few reasons that this may be occurring in the first place. I've done my best to organize solutions from easiest to perform to hardest to perform, though none of the solutions provided are too difficult. I would recommend trying the easier solutions before diving into the more complicated ones. With that in mind, let's hop right in. There's a couple of different reasons your Mac may be stuck while checking for an update. Considering that a Mac OS update file can be rather large, one of the most common issues is internet connectivity. An outage with Apple's servers. Insufficient storage space. Bugs in the SMC or NVRAM. Current errors relating to Mac OS. One of the first things you should do is restart your Mac. While this is not a solution that has a 100% guarantee, it works more often than one would think. Restarting your device is a way to start things over fresh, meaning any small bugs or issues are likely to go away. It also doesn't take that long. So if it doesn't work, you can move on to the next potential solution rather quickly. Another thing you should do is ensure you have a proper stable and strong internet connection. Check your connection and try the installation again. You may also want to check to see if Apple's servers are down. Without a strong connection on either end, the likelihood that you will experience problems checking for an update is high. You should also check to make sure that you have enough storage for the update. I will cover this more below. One other thing that you can try is ensuring that the time on Mac OS is correct. When Apple is checking for updates, it typically needs to know that everything is correct on your end to move forward. If your time is off for whatever reason, this is likely to cause issues. Go to Apple's system settings from the menu bar. Select General. Choose Date and Time. Ensure that Set Time and Date automatically is enabled. Older versions of Mac OS can also click on the clock in the top right corner. Select Open Date and Time Preferences. Click the lock to make changes, and then ensure Set Time and Date automatically is selected. One of the most common ways to solve the issue of a Mac being unable to check for updates is to boot it into Safe Mode and trying to install the update from there. Safe Mode can be a good alternative to a typical installation, as it only runs the things a Mac absolutely need to perform, such as certain required kernel extensions. It also verifies your startup disk and checks it for errors. Before you boot into safe mode, you will need to know if you have a Mac or Intel processor. You can check this from Apple's About This Mac. If you see the word Intel in the processor category, you know what you're rocking. Go to Apple's Shutdown. Wait for the device to properly shut down, then press and hold the power button on your Mac until you see Loading Startup Options. Choose a volume, then press and hold the Shift key. While holding the key, select Continue in Safe Mode. You will know you're in Safe Mode if you see the words Safe Boot in the menu bar. Shut off your Mac. Then, when you are starting it up again, hold down the Shift key as you power it on. Hold the Shift key until you see a login window. Log into your Mac. You may be asked to log in again. You will see the words Safe Boot in the menu bar when performed correctly. Once you are in Safe Mode, try installing the Mac OS update. Users can also try using Terminal to install a Mac OS update which has the potential to bypass any bugs that may be occurring. Typically found in the Utilities folder, here's how you can install Mac OS using Terminal. Open Terminal, then type the following command and then hit Enter. Enter your password. You can use this command to fetch the installer. You will then need to find the file in your Applications folder to install it. This line of code will install and automatically download the update.
Users are also able to use Activity Monitor to perform a refresh on the software update service. Hopefully one of the other solutions works before resorting to this one, but it is a viable option. Launch Activity Monitor. It's typically found in the Utilities folder, or you can hit Command plus Spacebar to launch Spotlight and search for Activity Monitor that way. With Activity Monitor open, type Software Update, one word, into the search bar. You will then find and select comapple.preference.softwareupdate.remove service after you select it. Click the X within the title bar to force quit the process. Try going to System Settings General Software Update and see if it works for you. Try not to keep the Software Update panel open while you do this. It will not hurt anything, but you will receive a warning. Another thing users can try is resetting their NVRM and SMC. With NVRM, this stores certain settings to help a Mac quickly start up and perform at its best. If there are bugs within NVRM, this can cause issues. If you are using an Intel-based Mac, reset your NVRM by holding Option plus Command plus P plus R for around 20 seconds while booting up your device. Release the keys when you hear a second startup sound from your device. There's a lot of reasons to enjoy using a Mac. However, it's not so enjoyable when things are not running as they should. If you're experiencing issues with your Mac stating that it's unable to check for an update, know that you have options available. With luck, it's likely a small issue with an easy fix that's keeping you from updating your device. Keeping Mac OS up to date can be incredibly important for a plethora of reasons. In addition to security updates and exploit patches, a machine that is current with its operating system is likely to perform better, which ultimately keeps a user happy. That's it for today, guys. If you're in need of a solution on Mac, we've got your back. For example, if you're having issues with your Mac not booting into recovery mode, we've got just the solution for you. Another important one for Mac users is knowing what to do if your external hard drive isn't showing up on your Mac, which can be a big help for those that really need that external. When it comes to problems, there's usually a sound solution. Don't forget to like and subscribe at Mac Observer for more intuitive guides, tips, and Apple news. This is Mike here. See you next time.